Time Enforcers. Saving the day one era at a time. Unveiling Time Enforcers, the backstory behind the game. Hi, I'm Paul Hebert, and welcome to this official unveiling of the backstory for the soon-to-be-launched video game, Time Enforcers. Will you step up to the challenge to save time as we know it? Can you stop the maniacal chronolith from destroying the very fabric of our reality itself? Stick around to the end of this video to find out about the cool offerings if you sign up with the Time Enforcers Agent Corps. Time Enforcers, a time travel game that sends players into a fun and interactive experience to learn about history while taking on the dastardly minions of Chronolith. The game is suitable for kids and those kids who are kids at heart. From conceiving the idea for the game, to developing the story and characters, to learning a new programming language, to animating characters and scenes, and creating and implementing a marketing campaign for the game's promotion. Time Enforcers, as you see it now, has been a three-year journey and a backstory that I'm very happy to share with you. But before we get into those details, if you can take a moment to like our video and subscribe to our channel, you will have our heartfelt thanks. Time Enforcers combines a role-playing experience allowing interaction with real-life characters from the past, present, and even future civilizations with the storytelling of a digital comic book. Somewhere Mingling with what's been and what might be, the player enters a world to save our current timeline from the evil schemes of Chronolith, the imperial ruler of the transdimensional realm. <laughs> At this point, it may be good to hear a little bit about my background I graduated from the Rhode Island School of Design with a degree in graphic design and received my MBA from Fairleigh Dickinson University. My devotion to my family, being an ethical and honest business person, and my desire to make a meaningful difference in people's lives are at the heart of all I do. These are the characteristics that form the inspiration to develop a game like Time Enforcers. The catalyst that led to this game's development resulted from the events during the COVID-19 pandemic. It was a time that unified us all while we lived in isolation. I observed the impact this had on my children's education, as well as the well-being of our family. To bring some additional joy to our household, in August of 2020, we decided to add a new member to our family, Suki. While making the 10 hour round trip from New Jersey to Maryland to get Suki, I reflected on the time our family was coping with the pandemic and its impact on us all. I marveled at my children's perseverance to stay committed to their education despite the challenging circumstances of learning in an all virtual environment. I observed the dichotomy of the challenges posed by learning entirely online while recognizing the opportunities technology offers for enriching a learning experience. It was on this trip that the concept of Time Enforcers was born. Time Enforcers provides a fun, wholesome, educational, and accessible experience for learners of all ages. I aim to achieve standards for an inclusive educational experience by incorporating closed captioning and vibrant visuals into the storyline. My wife, Mary, a seasoned educator and specialist in accessibility and education, has helped in guiding this universal design of the delivery of the game format. The core concept behind Time Enforcers allows for the development of many new and exciting levels and experiences. Opportunities to continually expand the Time Enforcers universe is only limited by the vastness of history itself. Truth be told, researching topics for this game is as much fun as creating, drawing, animating, and programming content. When we were young, didn't we all fantasize about using a time machine to travel back into the past and wonder where we might go, who we might meet, and what part of history we might observe? In a world of digital barrage for kids, I hope this game provides a fun experience for educational inspiration. 
The goal is to get them interested in learning more about the game's characters and the times in which they lived. Well, fellas, I think it's about time you called in someone with a bit of moxie to help clean up this mess. The learning experience offered here is not meant to stop at the doorstep of the game. The learning can be used as an entry to a passageway for players to learn more about the topics being presented. That's why a list of cited references used to research the information presented in the game is displayed in the closing credits and on our website at timeenforcers.com forward slash references. Oh, I almost forgot. Time Enforcers is not just a role-playing game. I am an avid comic book collector, and I love reading comics. Few media combine the craft of storytelling with the visualization of the story with art. Much like the success of graphic novels, presenting a story this way can be a great way to entertain and convey a message because the reader can consume the information from a multi-sensory perspective. I've always loved the cinematic storytelling of games like Destiny 2 and God of War. That's why, in addition to this role-playing aspect of this game, Time Enforcers also includes a digital comic book to tell its story. You will likely note the retro-style format with engaging character voices and comic book-style closed captioning. Yes, word and thought balloons pop up all over the place. This style of storytelling helps support players' various learning levels and needs. Expanding the reach of Time Enforcers beyond Mission 1. We want to take the Time Enforcers value proposition to the next level and look into other avenues to expand learning opportunities. These include publishing a bi-monthly magazine, featuring background stories about the characters from the game, and additional information about their real-life counterparts. Enabling GPS technology to bring historic sites located around players to life. A multiplayer version of the game where groups of friends can get together to fight Chronolith and his minions and find clues to uncover historical facts to solve puzzles within the game. And to form partnerships with schools and education programs to provide students with a fun and interactive learning experience. Thanks again for listening to my story. I wholeheartedly thank you for helping me to continue to realize this dream and bring the game development of Time Enforcers to the next level. Lastly, you too can sign up to be an official Time Enforcer agent and join the Galactic Space-Time Consortium in thwarting Chronolith's evil scheme to rule over all manner of time and space. When you sign up with the Time Enforcers Agent Corps, you will be among the first to hear about the official release of Mission 1, Time Out of Time in Feudal Japan, and have an opportunity to get your hands on a cool Time Enforcers merchandise like our official Time Enforcers Agent t-shirt. I happen to have one right here. It comes in both adults and kids sizes. You've got your cool Time Enforcer Agent logo on the front, and then our Time Enforcer Agents in character on the back in full color. Really cool t-shirt. And also, we have a soon-to-be-produced Chronoth Minion Arrow figurine. Measures about six inches in height, and it's great to have on your desk. I love mine. It's only a prototype, but I can't wait to develop these in full production. Now I'd like to pass over the mic to one of our Galactic Space-Time Consortium founders, C.T. Haugens. Take it away, C.T. Thanks, all. Professor C.T. Huggins here. I look forward to you joining the ranks of the Time Enforcers Agents Corps and helping us defeat Kremlin. You may be tough, but I know with your help, the GSTC can be even tougher. Thanks again for watching, Agent, and good luck.